Hey guys, I have a book haul for all you. I went to um, Barnes & Noble actually to pick up one book and wound up spending all my money. So <laughs> that's what happens when you go in there. Well, if you like books. So I wanted to get this new cookbook by the Pioneer Woman. You guys hear me talk about her all the time. I use a lot of her recipes. And it, I don't know, something about her recipes. You know how when you try a different recipe, different cooks and stuff, um, some, well, I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I'll try some recipes from different cooks and they, they either won't come out right or I won't like them or something, you know, I mean, not always, but sometimes. Everything that I've ever tried from her has always came out so good. So I, I really like her recipes. But this came out and it was 30 bucks and I was actually in Walmart with Dave and found it for 20 bucks. So that was a good deal. This didn't come from Barnes & Noble, though you can get it there. It came from Walmart. And at Barnes & Noble, it is $30. So this was a good deal. This is her newest one. And this, this is, um, it's a holiday edition. So it has the year of holidays. See, it has New Year's, football, Valentine's, Easter. You know, it has all the holidays. And then I went to Barnes & Noble to get one of her other books. There's two, well, there was two more that I wanted to get. So I got this one. What's all over it? Something's all over it. Aw. I love the covers of them. They're so pretty, especially yellow. Yellow is my favorite color. So this one's just um, just a regular one. It's not, you know, holiday or anything like that. It has all kinds of good stuff in it. It has some of the recipes that I've showed you guys, actually, that I've made. So, and this one was 30, I believe. Let me see. Yeah, $30. They're not cheap. And the last one that she has that I want to get is, I think it's like 27 So it's a little bit cheaper. So that came from Bonds & Noble. And then I saw this and thought this was just so neat. I'm all about this self-sufficiency stuff. I just can't get my family to be about it. So I can only, you know, go so far with it. <laughs> but it's, um, it has all kinds of stuff in it. See, bacon, crafts, gardening. Um, cannon, raising animals, all kinds of stuff. And it just is filled with information. Homemade ketchup. Tells you um, how to can, like the time and the pressure and what kind of jar to use and has recipes. Make your own yogurt, has cheeses. Just it's just filled with stuff, not just food either. So this was pretty neat. And uh, this was cheap. It was oh damn, I took the sticker off. I believe it was $7.98. So that was a good deal. And then the last one I got was this. Wuthering Heights. I but I grabbed this to check out. I really, really love the style of these books. I think they would look so nice on a bookcase. You see? I don't know. Is that stupid? <laughs> but I started it. I only got a couple page into it, pages into it. I can't really explain to you what it's about because I'm not sure. The only thing I got from, this one doesn't have, doesn't tell you what it's about, but there was another one there that did. And the only thing I got from the back of it was um, something about, well, it takes place in England, I believe, or Lon London, I think. I don't know. But it's back in the day, like in the 1800s, and that sounds boring, doesn't it? <laughs> well, if you like um, those shows like Downton Abbey or Upstairs, Downstairs, I think maybe you would like this. So that's what I got at Barnes & Noble. Oh, I forgot one. I 
totally forgot. I thought there was another one. I got this one too. Oh, this one was $7.98, so I'm not sure how much that one it was. But I know it was it was cheap. It was one of these bargain priced ones. So I got this too. Superfoods. This is just recipes on um, you know, healthier versions of food. A lot of vegetarian. Look at those. Those are zucchini flowers, which we can't find around here. Nobody ever has them, and I would like to try them. That's the zucchini, and you take that pad off, and you can stuff it, and yummy. Well, maybe it's not yummy. I don't know, but I want to make these herb and garlic crackers. All right, now that is, yeah, it has smoothies, too. Lavender tea. I love iced lavender tea. Tells you how to make your own almond milk. Pretty neat. See that? All right, now that's my haul. I'm going. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you soon.